Simba, he's on fire, Simba! He's on fire! He's leaking benzene! Get some, right in your big, fat, drone face. All right, we're on him like a... Oh, his wing fell off! Hello, valued viewers. I hope you're doing wonderfully well. Today's viewer request is from this person. Hey, Supercap, did you see France intercepted a drone in the Red Sea with two gun bursts from an attack helicopter? Do you think Grim Reapers could do this in DCS? First, let's go and watch the original video. I'll put the link to this in the video description. Okay, Arma, verrouillé. Je prends les dispositions combat. Arma, pas gêné, pas épaule tire. Visuel. Let's see, bon, je parle pas de verture. Verture. Contact. C'est bon, moteur arrêté. Il y avait slash. Not much to say, viewers. You could see the helicopter locking up the target in its FLIR or optical sensor, fired its gun and shot it down. Pretty simple. So what we've got is a drone flying at about 200 feet at about 100 miles an hour towards a stricken tanker here in the Red Sea. It's a hooty drone. And we're going to launch various helicopters to try and shoot it down, starting with the more antiquated choppers up to the very sophisticated choppers. We'll start with first Hueys with a selection of side gunners and front gunners then we'll try gazelle various caliber cannon then we'll have a me 8 or me 17 with some side gun pods then we'll have another russian chopper a hind with twin fuselage cannon and then we'll have a camov i think that has a yeah, gun pod and a fuselage cannon and a finally apache you all know has a cool swivelable uh, 30 mil gun guys i can't really see this being very problematic all of these helicopters can go 90 or 100 miles an hour they can easily find it and probably easily shoot it down thoughts or predictions uh, i think the more rudimentary helicopters will be fun because you know we don't have like aim assist but then when we get to the more technologically advanced helicopters like the apache uh, we'll be able to use its uh, sensors to aid it and it'll be light work. Welcome in viewers. First intercept Hueys with forward facing miniguns. Uh, Simba, take us out heading 040, please. Um, guessing there's going to be a drone out there somewhere. Oh, I can see it. I can actually see it. No, that's a helicopter. No, it's a drone. Nope, there's a drone. No, it's a seagull. Brilliant. Uh, how do we want to do this? Do you want to go head on? Do you want to go around the back? Uh, I figure, I feel like going around the back. That way, we should be able to keep pace with it. Look at the pretty birds. They are lovely, aren't they? Love a good gull. Visual off the nose. Today, they'll be going about 100 miles an hour, viewers. Maybe slightly faster. The uh, drones, which I'm assuming is about what they do in real life. Starting to make the intercept turn. All right, hold fire until we're all on target. We might as well. We've got plenty of time. All right, I'm gonna go across to the one on the far side. Watch out! Watch out for over speed. We're probably doing 130 miles an hour. All right, probably our biggest threat is ourselves here. All You're right, my biggest threat. Agreed. Cap ready. Do we have permission to shoot down the drones from battle command? Yep. Permission battle command. Fire at will before we overshoot. Oh, he's got a base gun dogfight! I did not see that happening. Oh, Alright, I'm gonna chase my drone down. You do it. I'm just getting them off target. Oh, I just made... Oh, it disappeared. Right, one's disappeared. I can't find the others. We did not see this coming, viewers. Needless to say, we don't try this air, so... Alright. I'm in a turn fight. I'm coming to mine as well. Oh, this video is gonna be a lot better than I thought. Who would have thought, viewers? Come on, dog, get stuck in. I don't pay you by the hour. It's on my giant knob head. He's got a knob on his head. Problem is, I'm probably the world's worst helicopter pilot, viewers. That's probably the main problem here. When With this dogfight. All right, mine's down. Almost got him. How tough is this guy? Ich hasse dich. I mean, they are like 7.62 rounds, so. Yeah, got him. 
Um, that was absolutely zero challenge viewers. Let's try side gunners. Next viewers, side gunner. Simba punch it. Right, I need to get my eye in. Alright, no probs. So you need to get alongside them on their left? On their left. Yep. And we won't be able to dogfight them or... I don't know. How about... Oh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. We'll just see what happens. All you need to know is seagulls full of 7.62 do not leave much meat and they don't taste well. Mm. So don't go shooting the seagulls. Makes me hungry. All right, so if you get nice and tight with them, Simba, and at the same speed, it will give me time. This is quite a hard aim, this. I mean, that sounds like a you problem. Yes, it is. It is a me problem. All right. Coming left. Right, so if they're 100 miles an hour, that's about 93 knots. I'm just going to get my aim in just for a minute, find out where these bullets are going. All right. All right, let's get, let's get closer and slower. Viewers, if you absolutely have to take some drones out, I suggest doing this. Oh, yes, Simba! Did you see that? Right. I don't know what to do now. I haven't got enough... Um, you got to call them out. I haven't got enough angle, and I can only see one. I can't aim back enough, basically. There we go. It's... Okay, they've all gone dogfight mode. And I've lost visual on all. All right. One, three o'clock. Two o'clock. One. Nose. Somewhere. Yep, I got him off my nose. All right. Just gonna be on the left bank. Viewers, this is a terrible way of hunting drones, I've decided. An appalling way of hunting drones. Oh, he's going for the, he's going for the money shot. He's going for the tanker. Son of a bitch. Who does he think he is? I must shoot him down, viewers. I'm going to give him everything. A whole six barrels. That is unbelievably difficult to aim this thing. Yeah! Right, next target. I punched him right in the belly belly. I saw another one that was turning yes, towards the they're boat. basically on the same track but behind. They've gone back to formation. Yep. Two o'clock. Sons of bitches, get away from my oil tanker. I need that. It's my benzene. Mer benzene! One off target. How many times do I need to hit him? Oh my god, my gun stopped firing. Oh, I went to the wrong monitor. Yeah, he's on fire, Simba! He's on fire! He's leaking benzene! Get some, right in your big fat drone face. All right, we're on him like a... Oh, his wing fell off! That is most unfortunate. And that is sarcasm. Right. One more. I got him two o'clock in a right-hand orbit. All right, let's have him. Let's friggin' have him. Yours, look how close he is to the HMS benzene. I see a shadow, but that's all. All right, it's coming into sight. Visual, but no angle. Angle! And lots of visual. It's mo a trillion hits. Oh no, am I out of ammo? Oh no, oh no, switching to the other side. A thing happened. On the other side, get some. Leave HMS Benzene alone. Get All him, right, Simba. Catch him in the orbit. All right, take control of front guns and finish that sucker off. You know my thoughts on the drones. Get some. A tough little SOBs, aren't they? It's definitely easier from the front. More. I feel like it would be easier from the uh, co-pilot seat where you've got the front gun and can move. He's down. That was surprisingly difficult, viewers. Uh, let's try the next aircraft. Welcome back, viewers. We're now in Mi-8 Hips. Two gun pods, and I think from memory, each gun pod is twin 23mm cannon. Guys, let's do our switchology and get the chuff out of here. Uh, God. Um... Someone's ready. Quick. Testing. <laughs> uh, Simba, lead us out. Zero, four, zero. Now, this is a lot of firepower, viewers. Each of us have four 23mm cannon. Oh, I forgot my fan. I forgot my fan. My God. How do you turn the fan on? I'll just leave it. We'll survive without it, guys. It is 
right above your left eyeball and that panel that's kind of angled. Yeah, bottom I, row, I make it switch I to the right. See it. Roger. Fan on. Well done. Well remembered, Simba. Good Simba remembering did, something. Did you reach across and turn your uh, co-pilot fan on for him? Absolutely not. I'm now in full concentration mode. Uh, right. I'm just saying, two fans on make you go faster. They do. Won't they drain the uh, drain the generator though? They're very powerful fans, you know. But well, Simba. Also, can you go a little bit slower? We are noobs in this hip. Also, I don't know how to trim, but I'm going to ignore that. I kind of like the gun sight, or do I? I don't know if I like the gun sight. All right, we're going to start coming left soon. Okay. This is a really fast, powerful, fast helicopter, viewers. Loads of these were made, operated by loads of countries. I haven't found the Speedo yet. I know it's there. Remember, it's in uh, kilometers an hour, not knots. Okay. Right, turning. I get the feeling we're really fast. Airspeed is just to the right of your engine RPM. Yeah, I'm visual now, anyway. All right, I'm lined up on the right one. Are you in drop? Excellent. Fire at will. Then our biggest threat is probably ourselves. Take that, Will. Yes, son. Oh, this is great fun. Helicopter and DTS best helicopter. Spawn. I can't hit it. Yeah. Oh, best helicopter so far by far. I give you the Mi 8. Welcome in viewers. We are now going to try for our sins the side gun on the Mi 8. We've got two side gunners, myself and Dark. And I have no idea what cannon this is or what gun it is. It feels like a 50 cal. I imagine it's a 50 cal and it's probably going to be problematic. Um, pilots, when you're ready, please take us out. Um, we're on the left side of your helicopter, by the way. So you want to be on the right side. Ready, drop. Ready. I believe it's a 12.7, cal. Up and add, um... This is my favorite helicopter so far. This is really good fun, this one, viewers. Fun is important, you've got to have fun sometime. I'm slightly worried about our magazine uh, size and how we reload. Does anyone know the answer to that? So I Auto reload. All right, I'm still concerned. All right, drop. I think uh, for our sins and target deconfliction, I will try to stay at altitude with the drones. If you will go 50 to 100 feet above the drones, that way we can both line up with our door gunners having shots. Simba doing planning. Oh, there's a guy in the back. There's a guy in the back. Where did he come from? I don't remember being a guy in the back. It's a different gun. I don't know if it's bigger or not. Uh, how far to target? We can't see Jack out of these things. It's right off the nose. Hello, drones. Right, they're 100 knots. That is 200 kilometers an hour, pretty much. Apparently, we have a generator failure. All right, Simba, I'm just waiting until we get... Right, you can just concentrate on slowing down a titchy bit. Opening fire. Oh, God. Yeah, good shooting. One's, one's hit. Swing this round, Doc. All are hit and have gone in dogfight, Simba. All have hit and gone in dogfight. They're all left, nine o'clock. Yeah, the magazine's like friggin' 20 bullets. What's the point? So there's a friggin' pilot that looks through me constantly. I hate being looked through. All right, I got two off the nose, banking left, but third ones. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna give him, I haven't got hardly any elevation, so I can't do it in a bank. You gotta get up beside him. No, it's not as good as the Huey for side gunning, no way. All right, if you can adjust your altitude by 100 feet, drops. Yeah, very limited upwards elevation. Reloading. Oh, we're not gonna get him. We're never gonna get him. Good shit, drop, my boy. My boy right there. Oh shit, there's another one right there. Good flying oh, yeah, Simba. Reloading. Nice. Well done guys. You're right. Oh, you got him. Dead. You got him. Right. This flying drop. Wonderful. Simba, I've got nothing on the left, you know what I mean? I've got no targets apart from our friend. I don't know where they are. 
Uh, I'm making that, a, go back around again. making that a you problem. There's one flying right up on us right oh, now. Oh no, they're getting real close to the boat if that's the case. Oh, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes, viewings. Get some. Yes, I made him, I made him move. Woo! Oh, did I? Oh, did I? No, he's still carrying oh, on, you son of a bitch. Wall. There you go, Cap. Get some. Get some. Get some, you son of a... Get some. Get some. Get him dropped. Oh god! It appears he's yeah, missed it. Is he gone over the boat? He's gone over the boat. He's won, he's won, he's hey. won. Son of a bitch. Right, I'm shooting the boat. That was hard, viewers. It was hard to aim. We didn't have a huge amount of firepower and the magazine was tiny. So, next viewers, the SA342 Gazelle, a really awesome light scout helicopter. We've got a, I think it's a 20 mil cannon there. Sorry if I got that wrong. And we've got an absolutely unknown cannon on our other side. No idea what that is. I've completely forgotten. Uh, let me get my S ready. So, hip. Hip. Hip, 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 hip. Hip. Bonza. Uh, Simba, please lead us out. All right. Uh, oh. Yep, this isn't going to work. The Roger. moment I take off, my yoke stops. Responding. Roger Semba. I'll see if I can do it on my yep. own, guys. Uh, the boys have two. Uh, we've got two other boys with the gazelles, but they've got tech problems. Neither of them can get their rudder working. I don't know why, viewers. Mine works fine, so we'll see if I can do it on my own first. It's what we in the industry call a thing, viewers. A thing. Well, my love of helicopters has come right back today, viewers. I've enjoyed all of these helicopters so far. It is recognizing my, um, like, uh, my Joy-Con that I use to slew helicopter, or it slew, like, radars that's on my throttle. It's recognizing that, those inputs as stick inputs, even though they're not bound. That's oh, weird. Uh, there's a setting for that in the special settings. Friggin' monster, this thing. Oh my god! Just a bit of a handful. Can't keep up with it, it's gone high and I can't keep up with it. No, no. What a brilliant cannon that is! Wow! Really easy to aim as well. Uh. Because that was good. It was, I mean, it wasn't as good as me. Eight. Then again, it was only me on my own. So let's go to the next chopper, guys. Welcome back, viewers. Me, 24, behind a real beefcake of a uh, Soviet helicopter with twin fuselage 30 mil cannon uh, and the massive amount of switches we need to press to get it working. So let's get working on that. 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 That, 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 test firing. Bollocks! I've oh. just won the, uh, yeah. Oh, the all important fan wasn't on. Yeah! Right, cap ready. Oh my god, this is. Not the easiest to fly. There we go. We're good. Like riding a bike, viewers. Oh, God. Yeah, this is hard to fly. Or I've got my controls wrong, either. No, I'm good. I'm good. It's another fast helicopter. Look at that speed. They are 11 o'clock. Oh, yeah. Simba's ready. Cap ready. Mm, Alright, ready. Open Go fire. Ahead. Oh, the recoil on it. Shot 
sharp. Ooh. Right, went off, one went, went off to yeah. the right. Yeah. One went off to the right, but I've lost visual, guys. Alright. Pick so it up. Going right. Uh, I don't have it. I don't visual. have it. That was six. Just coming around. Yep. I gotta be on your what was what was your left? Yep. It's my one o'clock. Yep. Right. Shoot his face. Someone's got to hit it. Yep. I'm hitting him. Oh, merch. I'm going to have to go high and yo-yo. Viewers, it's got all the firepower, but it just doesn't have the control, or it's, or it's harder to control, should I say, than the others for relatively inexperienced helicopter pilots. Got it. He's gone. Yeah, we made a bit of a meal of it, but, yeah, it's definitely doable. Uh, right, next helicopter. Welcome back, viewers. We are continuing with an even bigger, meteor, more powerful helicopter, the Soviet Car 50. Uh, we've got the choice of either a long barrel, highly accurate, depressible 30mm fuselage cannon, or these, which I think are 23mm twins again. Uh, we'll probably just need the main cannon, to be honest. Right, um, got to remember how to fly it again. So pip, 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 pip. Pip, whoops, pip, pip. Cap ready. Simba ready. Arc ready. Simba, lead us out. I think this is the most powerful helicopter we'll be flying today. I think it's around 5,000 sharp horsepower from memory. Highly automated, relatively automated. It's got a really useful window. Pay off foresight, guys. That would be useful for dogfighting. Right, I'm going to try putting on the flight director and see if that helps. It does. If you know the autopilot, I would put the flight director on. It gives us a bit more control of our pitch and stuff. Now, this is the first um, aircraft with a blur type sensor in the front viewer, so we could technically lock up the target with our scrabble here target it like that but none of us know how to do that it's just been too long since we tried something like that so right, we're gonna do it the left old fashion way. i'm low and tight i'll try and get through to the left one wow this thing's maneuverable yep i'm ready when we are open fire god it's maneuverable look at that viewers i can just smash it Oh, right out of the airspace. I'm doing a charge forward to get closer to him. Guys, you can snipe if you want. Sharp, well done. Yep. Right. I'm going to go look for the one that turned around earlier. That's probably the priority. I'm sure there was one, Cap. I think it's just one remaining. Oh, right. Uh, anyone got eyes? Yep, yep. It's right out in front of me. All right. Dispatch him. This is going swimmingly. Somebody else take him. Handles the recoil much better than the uh, find. I just shot him on a brilliant aspect. Right. Wow, what a, what an aircraft viewers. What a friggin' aircraft. Give you the cam off. Watch the ground. Turn on a hit designate. Get a lock. Lock the cannon. Oh, try and fly. Sky now. Remember that I'm flying a helicopter. Oh yeah, took its wing right off. 
Oh, I hit the wrong button. I'll have to redo these now. Lock target. Find this last guy. Lock him up. one big burst and it's gone. Okay, well that's um, how easy it is in this, even if you don't know how to fly a helicopter. US last of course is going to be the AH-64D Apache with its plethora of sensors on the nose which we'll use to uh, find and shoot the targets. First we've just got to set our junk up, so stand by. Fire's ready. Alright, I don't know where you are Simba, but take off and lead us there. Alright, off the ground. Visual. Let's go guys. Right guys, I'm tracking the one that's currently to our right. Once we get behind it, it will be to our left. Copy, I've got the far right target that's currently on our far left. Sure. Uh, we have a fully swivelable 30 mil cannon, of course, viewers. All right, we're approaching the merge, coming left. Roger, slightly slow, so I'm gonna be just a titchy little bit. All right guys, that is pretty much as it was in the video. Uh, far it will. One down. Which one? Last two. Wow. Just getting away, boys. Impact. Gone. Splash. Gone. Along. Definitely the best helicopter, guys. Let's go and land and let's talk about a debrief on the way back. It was a bit fun, viewers, but it was also a little bit of science. Um, uh. Got to land on the boat, Cap. Got to land on the boat. Um, which was the easiest to do in? It was obviously the Apache. Um, yes, we probably have more flight time in the Apache, but still, you could just tell by the way the boys were all over it and using their sensors. It was just impossible not to kill them immediately. I found the Mi-8 was probably the next best. Uh, bear in mind that we can't use the sensors on the uh, Camo. I can't remember how to use it. I've, um, has anyone got any other plans other than the Apache, which they thought was best for taking out drones? I kind of like the Huey, but then maybe that was a fun factor. It was fun, but the guns weren't powerful enough, the problem. You had to shoot them a hundred times. In that case, uh, which was the worst? For me, it was the Mi-24, which is a brilliant chopper, but man, if you're not a great helicopter pilot, that's a hard thing to control. I, I, I struggled. For me, it was the cam off, just because it's much slightly more awkward to fly. Yes. When you haven't flown it in a long time. Yeah, again, it needs, it needs proper learnings to fly it properly. Has it actually got a helipad? Wow, worst yep. landing ever. That's got to be dark. It has to be dark. Nope, that was nope. me. Nope. Nah. Yeah, the helicopter pad is right where Simba was trying to land. Yeah, but no no easing into it, boys. You got to, like, jet it's up to it, come Scandi to a flick. stop, and set it down. Scandi yeah, flick, all right. Even flick it. It's Vietnam, we're under fire. There's VC in the bushes. And Scandi flick. Arr, pull. And done the collective. And... What could possibly go wrong with this? I'm down! That's a perfectly acceptable landing. The US Army. Drop. You did not scan the Navy and flick it. You were out. Not sexy enough. It was just crashed in the water. No. Yes! Boys, that is how you land helicopters. Come on, guy. Land it. Hey, well, I survived beyond the career for a minute. Probably my best landing. Very proud of you. That's expert landing by an expert group of aviators viewers. Um, it was good. It was good fun. I hope you enjoyed that. And bye bye.